Hello there, I'm Natalie, and welcome to Beauty Busters, pew, 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 where we test out internet beauty, in this case, lazy beauty gadgets, to see if it's a poop, a whoop, or a maybe baby, meaning it may work for some people and it may not work for other people. Today! So it's been a hot minute since I've done my last Beauty Busters, but if you enjoy Beauty Busters, make sure you give this video a huge thumbs up so that I know to do more. Hold up, today is an exciting day because I am announcing the iPhone giveaway winner. The baby is going home with someone. Drum roll, please. And the prize goes to Aloma Bolel. Woo! Congratulations! But if you didn't win, no worries. The next giveaway will be announced in the next video. I want to give a huge shout out to Jaylin for watching my videos. Thank you so much. So if you want a shout out in my next video, all you have to do is be a part of the notification squad. So all you have to do is subscribe to Natalie's Outlet, turn on post notifications right here by clicking on that little bell, and then comment below hashtag notification squad when you're done, and I will be choosing one of you. That's it. It's that easy. I challenge you guys to get this video to 350,000 thumbs up. All my lazy potatoes unite. I dare you to turn this to this by clicking below and giving it a thumbs up. Add me on Instagram because I'm currently doing a huge giveaway where I'm giving my favorite makeup, Polaroid stationery, basically Natalie's essentials to you. Let's get on to the video. This lazy beauty gadget I've seen everywhere because I'm the kind of person that I'm not very good with applying my lashes and ain't nobody got time for that. I don't got time for that. I came across this three second lash magnetic eyelashes, applying your lashes on with magnets. I don't know. So it claims that it attaches instantly, it's lightweight, it's secure, I don't know. That whole secure part kind of freaks me out because it's just a magnet and the worst and most embarrassing thing I think is like talking to someone and your lash is just slowly falling off. So it says it's a three second lash, meaning it should apply on your eyes in three seconds. What do you guys think? Comment below right now, do you think it's gonna be a poop, a whoop, or a maybe baby? Whoa, this is heavy. Interesting, okay. So this is what it looks like. It comes with three different types of lashes, kind of like a thinner one, a medium sized one, and a much bolder one. And then it comes, oh. And then it comes with a little eyelash applicator, which is kind of convenient. Step one, place lash on top of your natural lashes. Number two, place the bottom lash under the natural lash so the magnets connect. Step three, perfection. Flaunt your flirty lashes. It's really nice because it says the top and then the bottom. So I'm actually gonna go for a bold one. Why not? I'm gonna use this one right here. So this is kind of big, I don't know. This is already pretty awesome because we're not dealing with all of that annoying glue. I'm gonna place this on top. I'm just the worst at applying lashes. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, I like that. We're gonna put the bottom part, this bottom part. Isn't magnets like bad for your eyes? Whoa! It just clipped. Okay, but it didn't clip right. Ooh. I'm gonna take this off, which is gonna be easy. Ooh, this is awesome. So far, so good. Like, it kind of looks cheap. The size of this doesn't look like it would go around your eyes, but it actually fit quite nicely. So I'm gonna take this away. I'm gonna give it another shot. Wait, which one is the top? Which one is the bottom? Oh yeah, this is the bottom, the one with the red. Place it there. It's actually easier with your fingers. Nah. And, um, uh, ha, ha, ha. You know what, from a distance, it's not that bad. I'm gonna try one more time. Okay, that one I got pretty good. Look at that. I'm gonna try another one. This is actually the medium size one. I'm gonna put it right here. So far, so good. I'm not even gonna lie, it's pretty good. Like, I would do this in a second. Imagine, like, just for a quick pick, a selfie, you put on your lashes, then you take them off. Okay, do you guys see that? a little bit higher. I'm gonna try it one more time. The fact that I'm not using this tweezer thing is kind of messing me up. I would take longer, quite honestly, putting it on with glue. That's just me. This is the final look. It's a little ratchet, I'm not gonna lie, but I have to say, it was very simple. These lashes look and apply a lot better than they look on here. Personally, I don't think it looks that bad. Like, I think because I don't have thick eyeliner going on right now, it looks a little shabby, but like I'm telling you guys, let's say you just want a really nice selfie, you want your eyes to pop, pop these on, take them off, that's it, you're good. I'm gonna try it on the other side and I'll let you guys know my final thoughts. It ain't bad. I'm gonna do the other eye. Place it on. All right, so this is the final look. I do not think it is too bad, personally, okay? I will say there are two faulty things about this product. Number one is, if you look closely, the magnet is right in the center, which really doesn't allow for much of a curve on the lash. For people like myself that have more like almond-shaped eyes, it's not as bad as for people that maybe have rounder eyes. There really is no bend 
to this. And then the second thing about this that isn't really my favorite is if you look closely again, do you see how the lashes are kind of bending a little bit? It doesn't look as good as it once did. So also, I feel like there's not a consistency when it comes to the amount of eyelash that is on. So this side, this was the full one, it looks a lot bigger than this one. And it's the same fullness. Other than that, I think the packaging is kind of cool. Personally, I would use this but not in real life. I will only use this when it comes to like pictures. I wanna glam up my eyes for just a quick second, but never in real life. I think they will hold. I personally do think they will hold, but it just doesn't look that flattering if you come real close. I would not use this out and about, but maybe at home, maybe in the dark. I'm at a distance, I think this looks really good. But I will say for $28, this is pretty expensive because you could buy a really good pair of lashes that could last you multiple uses. But hey, for an amateur like myself who doesn't really enjoy putting on eyelashes, I like this. It's not that bad. I give it a whoop. So this Lazy Beauty gadget honestly had me like, what, what, what? <laughs> blown away. I saw this on Instagram. I came across this video right here. I'm gonna show it for you guys. I have a very beautiful lady right here. Using the stick upward in an upward position, then over the eyes. Oh, do you see that? That is cray cray. I need that in the mornings. And then also on the lower chin. Wow. Okay, so this is a lifting stick, meaning for wrinkles, for just like your skin. If you are looking kind of ratchet one day, you haven't gotten your beauty sleep, your eyeball is like this. I get these puffy bags sometimes, so I understand. This hopefully will be the holy grail. This is what the product looks like. It's by Sermaj. I ended up getting it online through like a Korean store. It took a few months to get to me. And when you open it up, it kind of looks like Burt's Bees. It kind of smells like Burt's Bees too, with a little bit more of a clinical smell. And then it feels like glue. <laughs> that's really what it feels like. Like I swear, this would put my hairs down. Like that's what it feels like, like just pure glue. So even though I do have eye bags, I'm gonna be testing this out on my beautiful mother. She volunteered, she wanted to test this out, and we're gonna see if it works on her. Here we go. I didn't know what was in this, but Dennis is looking it up. So come on on and tell us what are the ingredients. Dennis is using Google Translate right now. And as you can see, we're trying to decipher what exactly is in this weird thing. Did that say urine? What? I swear it said urine. Does that say made in a garage? Made in a garage. Hold on. What? Okay, well we can't figure it out. So if you guys know, let us know in the comments. I am joined with my beautiful mother. I'm gonna be trying on the lifting stick on her. So she doesn't know what it is. She's never seen any videos on it. Or she was really excited for this because she was like, oh, okay, my wrinkles get to disappear away. I don't get wrinkles. <laughs> <laughs> That's right, that's right. Okay, so supposedly it claims, this is the Crimage lifting stick. It lifts skin in five seconds by just swiping away the wrinkles on the cheeks, the lips, and anything that's sagging. So my mom does have a little bit of blush on, so we're gonna remove it. My mom is beautiful. Beautiful, young, and free. So it looks like it has this little cap on. This is what it smells like. Tell me, what do you think? Mm, what do you think? Smells it smells like... a little like glue. It's sticky. Yeah, it is. It is. Let me see how they use it. We're gonna lift this up like that so that it's good to use. There's a little bit of that thing on her. It fell apart a little bit. How does it feel? A little bit cold. Ooh. Do I see a difference? Not yet. Not yet. <laughs> I'll keep going. Oh, let's do the cheek. So mm -hmm. this is the cheek. Yes, but really I had wrinkle. <laughs> okay. So they seem to go like in an up motion. I'm gonna do her eyes one more time, and now her cheeks. So now we're gonna go up. It looks like it's gluing your skin together. Whoa. Yeah. Oh my God, mire. Wow, it's the most tight. But for how long? <laughs> <laughs> Until your date is over. Wow, ma. Yeah, because she wants it on that side. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna... Okay, okay, okay. So my mom is really interested in the other side. So first, let's do a before. That is before. Perfect. And now, <laughs> beauty is pain. It would probably be smart if before using this product, you used it on one little area in case you're allergic to it, right? Entonces que piensa la verdad. Está bueno el producto, sí, pero hay que ver por cuánto tiempo sí, trabaja. ¿Qué tal que a los 10 minutos ya esté otra vez? I mean, I see a slightly a difference, uh -huh. but I want to know what it feels like on your skin. Does it feel like you can't move? No, I feel okay. How comfortable is it? 
It is. It's comfortable. Yeah? You like it? Yes. Would you use this again is the question. Yes. Did I see the results? Of course. Her face feels a little bit tacky. It kind of feels like Burt's Bee lip balm. That's about it. But she says it's not uncomfortable. It's kind of similar to like a primer where it like fills in the lines. Whoa! Sí, mom. sí, se ve muy diferente. Aquí ya no tengo la ruga esa del payaso. Wow! Pero que era lo que hace? Paraliza el nervio, okay? <laughs> Honestly, I don't know what ingredients these are. It's like a Korean thing though. Thank you, mother, for being on this. The final thing is whether you think it's a poop that it didn't work, a whoop that it's really good, or it's a maybe baby, meaning it might work for some people and it may not work for others. What do you think? For me, it's a whoop. A whoop? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's a new one. A whoop? A whoop. A whoop, uh -huh. whoop, whoop. Yeah, but the concern is for uh -huh. how long? True. How long yeah. does this actually last? Yeah. Call me when your face falls. Yeah, okay. I will. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed today's Beauty Busters. If you did, make sure you give it a huge thumbs up. Check out my last video right over here by clicking on it where I show you some amazing travel gadgets that you need to know about. Subscribe right over there by clicking on my face. I post new videos every Wednesday and Saturday. And just make sure you have notifications turned on by clicking on that little bell. Literally punch it. That way I'll see you twice a week. I hope you have an amazing day. Don't forget to live weird or die normal. Bye.